We found a couple carpets and started to assemble the carpet frame right in the middle of the street. So we measured twice and cut once because we didn't have enough spare materials in case we made a mistake. It's also important to know that I had to make sure that the frame was the same size as the e-foil board as well. It was 110 degrees outside in the middle of July when we started to film so it was pretty brutal. What's going on guys? This is seriously going to be probably one of the best days of my life. I'm going to get this carpet, put it on this e-foil board and ride across the ocean like Aladdin flying on a magic carpet. They're pretty difficult to ride and that's coming from somebody who has endured board sports his whole entire life. This is the training and progression that I went through. So after it was finished, we basically hoisted the board up, took it out of the water, and gave it a shot. Which immediately failed. We had two things going against us at this point. Time is running out fast and there was about 30 minutes of daylight left, but as soon as I got in deep water, the frame snapped. The carpet started to get all disorganized and it came underneath the board. Basically, it broke, so I didn't get the shot that I wanted to get, so we're gonna try one more time. Hopefully the board doesn't break, because if it breaks just one time, I think we're done. I don't think we'll be able to do anything else for the rest of the day. With about only 20 minutes of daylight left and 10 minutes of battery power on the e-foil, I knew this was my last chance. I felt the heaviness of the ocean weighing me down. Literally, my costume and the magic carpet was soaked in ocean water. But we didn't come this far to half sin. This is exactly what we came to do. The beautiful Burj Khalifa in the background, my cape somewhat blowing in the wind, and Aladdin flying on an optical illusion of a magic carpet. Mission accomplished. So I used CGI to remove the mask from the e-foil board and that's how you got these final shots.